so far we have seen the introduction to cad cam and ce technology and tools we have also seen the application areas where industries are using these tools how exactly we can utilize those tools also we have seen the classification of tools what are the tools available and uh, what exactly will be our focus if you want to build our career in engineering design field we have also seen introduction to katia where we have discussed the full form of katia kernel of katia as well as the developer resolve systems then we have seen the application areas modules available in the software we have also seen the graphical user interface of the software and we have discussed the syllabus that uh, we are going to cover in the course as a first step let's start with the sketcher a sketcher is basically your 2d work environment where we will be creating the sketches like line sketch some complex shapes as well but uh, this time our sketches we have to create in such a manner that those sketches will be ready for being converted into 3d we have to create those sketches as a support to the 3d environment to accessing the sketcher environment i'll go for start mechanical design sketcher i'll repeat again start mechanical design sketcher now you can see the new part window is still available with me as i had defined in the settings in the new part window it is asking me for the part name not for the sketch name still i will give it as sketch 1 i will keep all these settings as off and uh, i'll just i do i want to show the dialog box again so i'll say okay this is my sketcher environment the interface looks similar which we had discussed the access system is available as uh, i have defined to create the access system while opening a new file so access system is available if you want the planes then uh, from the feature tree you can right click on the planes and you can show them and you can hide the access system if required now the environment which uh, i had opened was uh, start mechanical design sketcher but this particular environment does not look like a sketcher environment because there are some tools available for uh, converting those sketches into 3d as you can see the toolbar available this one the sketch based feature toolbar it is named as so this is the toolbar which actually requires the sketches i don't have the sketches available right now but if you will see on the right hand side this one toolbar is available this is your sketcher toolbar and one tool out of that is selected this orange color actually indicates the selected tool and if you will focus on the command bar then the command bar is actually explaining you what to do command bar is asking you to select a plane planar face or a sketch currently i don't have any sketch available i don't have any planar face as well but yes i do have the plane available so it is asking me to select a plane planar face or sketch i will select a plane out of these three planes from the access system or i can select it from the feature tree as well say i am selecting a plane i am selecting yz plane for that now this is actually looking like an sketcher environment we have tools to create the sketches we have tools to modify the sketches we have some toolbars for uh, selection filters we have toolbars for sketching tools etc so this is how i will be able to enter into the sketcher environment now i had opened sketch sketcher environment but the software has given me the part design environment 
and from the part design environment i am entering into sketcher environment the software actually does not have a separate sketcher environment whenever you want to access the sketcher environment then you will need to go through some other environment only like some other software you cannot save a separate sketcher file or the files of katia does not have any separate file extension for sketcher files if you are saving any sketcher file then it will be saved as the part only because when we had opened start mechanical design sketcher in that also it was showing new part window because by default we are creating the part only we are not entering into sketcher environment we are entering into part only now let's say if i'll go for uh, start mechanical design and part design i'll just close this environment i'll go for start mechanical design part design again it is asking me the same thing i will say okay to this and you can see the environment now the major difference if you will go for start mechanical design sketcher then this particular sketcher tool will be activated but if you will go for some other environment then this particular tool will not be activated so if you want to enter into sketcher environment then separately you don't have any sketcher environment available but yes from any other environment whether it is part design whether it is surface design or sheet metal or any other you can enter into sketcher environment by using the tool available in the sketch toolbars